Hello and welcome back to Nortristi. <clears throat> so we've kind of went ahead and farmed a little bit off and on. Expanded this out a little bit more. Um just to try to get some kind of organization. If it's gonna work, I don't really I don't know, I'll probably change it like sorry I got the burps a couple hundred times anyways. But we get the nature's aura right here. Oh, I also need, I need logs, any kind of logs. Let's take some of these. 22, I, I know that's more than enough, but let's also take, I did get a lot, ooh, almost took them all. A lot of go leaves, which is, good because that's what we're going to work on right now i kind of want to get this set up and started this is my little area down here which i right now to do this is i don't know i'm just kind of just going off you know this is how it's going to look at the moment and we'll spread as you know as we go and i imagine botania is probably going to end up spreading out but my idea at the moment is to kind of have this like the major storage area up here on top for all the botania power like power and stuff like that and then everything else underneath and let's see this one some that's a rare that's from minus slash that one i think is from bewitchment i think it's salt no that's salt what is this okay that's minus slash was this one? Oh, Silver War from Bewitchment. Oh my god. And this one is uh, Fortify Iron. I think that's all. Yeah. Okay, let's go down here. Now, I we went ahead and put two of the Bewitchment trees up, which we also went ahead and updated the Bewitchment. Hopefully it doesn't crash or anything. And I put the Thumbcraft Silverwood sapling, but I think it's too... I don't think it's enough room that it's going to grow, so I might have to end up taking that out. Now, according to this, I do a go leaf with a tree trunk, and that will get me a wooden stand, and I need, let's see, six, eight. I need eight wooden stands. So, if I go into here... I go like this and then like that or is it the other way around yeah so it's one two three four five six six and then seven eight so that's eight stands right there and then so that unlocked something now according to the book we're wanting to grow this plant right here which I hopefully I got enough room in here can I do this? Does that allow me to... Oh, okay. So, we're just going to do it right there. Um, shift, right click? No. Shift, left click. Wait, did I just put double? No, okay, I got, I got it set. Okay. So, this... There... Oh, you see that the bar at the top tells me how much I've got already? That's nice. I like that. And then we'll put this one right here. And then this right here. And then to get this, like, gold powder, I think all I have to do is just do this. Yeah. So let's take... 16 should do it, I would say. Hopefully. So it goes like this, this, this take that out kind of works like glowstone in a way over there over there over there over there over there over there and then we're gonna have to get a sapling in the middle see it's 24 or 25 so we're gonna get we're gonna get a sapling up here and then I think I'm gonna go ahead and get a little bit of all, all this is almost filled, so like I got three slots right there, one slot right there, 
the top of the wood right there and then four slots over there we're going to go ahead and probably start connecting more chest underneath i was wanting a sapling which the saplings are over here and then i wanted some no not wait that's dark oak i just want an oak sapling i need to find out which other I still don't have a jungle sapling. I can't believe I don't have a jungle sapling. And then let's get some, uh, some. We need to make some more bone meal. Yeah. So that's 24, 25. I would like to get some of these trees going to go ahead and start getting some magic in the area. Boom. Complete. All right. Bone meal. Let's go. Oh, come on. You tell me that's not high enough? Oh. How is that not high enough? It's an oak sapling. <laughs> Mistakes were made. Oh, we did find a... A mystic tool ring. Which provides strength to fire resistance, jump one, haste two, speed two. And we've gotten ran through like a whole bunch of I found another dungeon somewhere and one small town but we've ended up these the like the dragons and the mobs and everything they eat through this armor like crazy so it kind of stinks in some ways but at least we're getting a ton of armor I guess I'm trying to keep like the decoration armor out because hold on I'll get the the oh, well, let me go ahead and get this let's, let's get a few of these one more I'll show you what I'm talking about some of the like the mods or some of the armors look just like normal oh, that's weapons but you got like this right here the samurai helmet um, the hunter coat helmet pillager helmet you know and the vanguard helmet some of these look a little bit different than normal and so i'm trying not to use any of those as i did and every time i get um any pages in here i go ahead and unlock anything i end up finding which so far i mean we've got a decent amount now these dragons oh my gosh they've been kicking my but I am nowhere near able to go ahead and take out our dragon. Wrong way. Oh, I did add in this. I added in another one over here and another one over here. And then I've got it linked where whatever I throw in there will go ahead and deposit it into the system. So at least I'm getting some of the things going. Not much. But at least the cook. Like a little bit. Let's see. Sorry. I'm bouncing all over the place. Should be used to it by now. There, come on. Give me just a small little tree. That's all I need. There you go. Okay. What is this supposed to do now? <laughs> um, okay. So we do that. And it grows together with the ritual. Knowledge of tokens can be gained. This is supposed to give me the tree, right? It's not doing anything. It's not doing anything. Okay, let's look at Experimental. We don't want the experimental eye. Ancient tree, that's what we want. So I gotta put this around it in order to get a, an ancient. So it's a dandelion, a gold leaf, seeds, oak saplings, sugar cane, and poppy. So I understand. Does it have to be grown? See, I thought we were already at the stage where it would do it already. I didn't think we were. Nature's R is one that I just I don't know anything about. Let's look at this right here. We got a poppy. And sugar cane, oak sapling, seeds. I don't know if I got sugar cane up there. 
I don't know if I got sugar cane at all, to be honest. I don't think I've... Sugar? Oh, I do. Give me that. See? See what I'm talking about? How it ends up being double? And then it's, uh... So dandelion, poppy. We already got poppy. We need a dandelion. And that one. Then we need a seed. Which is way over here. Yeah, right here. So we've already got those three. All right, we need one more thing. One more thing. What was the last thing? Another oak sapling? Yeah, I guess so. So I wonder if the tree actually let me take a couple of the let me take a couple of those. I don't know if the tree has to be grown or if it's gonna grow. Wrong way. Let's go down here. Now, I, don't, I hope it doesn't have to be like any specific order. I don't think so. But we're about to find out, I guess. And then let's see. One right here. How much is that? One, two, three, four, five. Okay. So, boom. Boom. And then we're skipping one right there. Boom. That one and that one. Okay. So do I need this tree chop down and it be a sapling? Okay, let's go ahead and just in case. Let's go ahead and chop all this down. Let's get rid of all that and we'll put that in the middle. What's it supposed to do now? We got all the things around it. Basic way of replenishing the aura as the area is the ancient trees. Once an ancient sapling is created, it will grow like a normal tree. But its leaves will start increasing the aura levels back to normal slowly. The tree, however, does not fare well during the process and its leaves are okay. Creating the ancient sapling using them. So do I have to have this just like that okay so because it's not doing anything so a dandelion and seeds so a dandelion and seeds you're just right clicking to get it off okay I'm just making sure it, it might have to be where it's specific and then it's oak sapling sure cane and poppy so, oak, sapling, sugarcane. No, give me that. Why did it give me the... Oh, that's from the other one. So, we're going to put that right there. And oak, sapling. It's not doing anything. Does it have to be in the sunlight? That might be a possibility. What in the world? All right, so it's not growing down here. So let's go. We're gonna go ahead and take up all this. And we're gonna go into the sunlight and see if that affects it. Can I? Okay, we get this back. That's awesome. I wish it glowed like glowstone. It looks like glowstone. Alright, let's run upstairs and we're gonna. Okay, I think we got everything. We're gonna sleep, which I need to move my bed to. So we know now that we cannot do that downstairs. If I did it right. Possibility I didn't do it right. Alright, let's go outside and see if we can do it outside. Which is another reason why it, it, ooh, we 
need to go ahead and make a fireproof house. All right, so this is going to end up being a tree in the middle, which is going to end up being like this. Is that right? Here. And then according to the book, it's like... Oh, no, wait. I'm clicking on the wrong things. I just need uh, ancient trees. Why are you not doing it? Um, ritual forest, which is this right here. All right, so we're gonna go boom. Oh, boom. Is that okay? That works. So, tree in the middle. One stands around. Okay, so we got all that, and then on this side, we are going to tree in the middle. So on this side, go back one, ancient trees we need. On this side, we'll do dandelion, gold leaf, and seeds. So right here, um, I was about to say, where did my dandelion? Gold leaf and seeds. So it should be... Dandelion, go leaf, and seeds. And then on this spot right here, it's going to be poppy, sugarcane, and oak sapling. So. Right here. It's still not working. And if I put that in the middle, the basic way of printing. Okay, so it's not gonna... It's not growing. You see that? Do I gotta click it with a book, maybe? Or do I gotta click it with... Uh, some of this goat powder? Oh, no, not the gold powder. What about golden leaf? No? What about empty handed? Nope. See, it's just a regular. Oh, there it goes. So it's got to grow up, and then it goes ahead and takes it. So it, if I would have. Well, there you go. If I would have left it down there, it would have went ahead and finished. I just got impatient. Now, my next question is, can you take this tree, which we need a ton of the material, can we take it and put it in one of the bonsai trees over here? After we 40 minutes of playtime before I start lagging. Okay, perfect. Ancient sapling can go in there. Awesome. That can go ahead and start uh, popping up. Oh, too bad we can't get that. Okay, so we got that going, which is great. See, I'm getting laggy. There you go. That will open up quite a bit of stuff because we can start making this material right there that we need. And we can go on to here. Our bottling, which we have some of those already made with the cork. We have some sunlight already made. 
Uh, ah, we're slowly going ahead and getting into that. What is this? On creating aura. Or, uh, creating aura is a practice that will quickly be required by any magical botanist making use of it. Now, here's one thing that I've run into. I've ran around and tried to get leaves and everything, but I'm going to have to go ahead. Whoop, wrong way. I'm going to have to go ahead and go get some just regular flowers because I am having trouble getting botania flowers to get this set up to where we can go ahead and go. What do we got here? Silver, fortified iron, and then coarse iron. I don't know if I'm going to have this go back and this go back and this go back a little bit. I haven't decided yet. But we got at least a little bit of going. But yeah, I just want to touch base on this. We've got Nature's Aura up and going. We're pumping out the flowers as far as that goes. And we're still creating, you know, more stuff. I think we're going to go this way is going to be Bombcraft. And I think below this, maybe below over here, will be... I don't know. I'm still playing around stuff. But since again, a lot of the mods we need to go ahead and get started on so it keeps it starts pumping up so we can go ahead and you know go with it. I think we're gonna end up I hate this. I hate that it doesn't let me put it in there. And I hate that it Well, it does that, which we that might be what we end up doing. Because I can go ahead and stack them. It just looks better to me. And it just might be my imagination. See, that one's full, and then we can go over here. I just don't like these little ones. But we might just do chests across here and just do, uh, like, the splash potions and everything up top here. I'm still playing around with some stuff. We'll see how it ends up going. We're going to end up using these soon, too. This doesn't have as much as I would like for it to. It's only 421. It's just not that high at the moment. Everything I've done has not went ahead and increased the strength of it, which is kind of disheartening. But at the moment, I just now updated it. So I'm not sure if I need to go ahead and rip this whole thing up and then put it up because I'm not sure looked and I was actually like fifth no it's about 10 uh, patches behind on bewitchment so that's a significant amount to be behind on a mod so we'll have to see how that ends up going but I also need to go into the nether which the nether ends up being dark you probably saw last time and I'm gonna find out I'm thinking that I might put I don't know if it's going to end up working, but we're going to try to go ahead and see if um, if down here, if I can put the Twilight Forest mod, if it actually shoot lightning through. I'm just going to put it in any random spot. I don't have anything in particular where I want to put. Hell, I might put it right here. Up, oh, that's got water. Okay, maybe not there. I forgot I put water right there. Get it. There you go. I don't know. We'll put it somewhere. But we got to go farm some more materials and everything. And I think that's going to be pretty much it for this episode. We'll pick up in the next episode and we'll see which way we're going to end up going. We're not really worried about the armor at the moment. We're kind of just... I want to get rid of all these chests. That's the go which the machinery was going to end up being down here back behind here where you can't see it but i just noticed that there is a town the first town i found there is a merchant in it that has pets which i need to find out which one it is which mod it ends up being but it's got like a a lot of cages with parrots and um, the cats and the wolves 
but they're starting to get out because the hose blown in the side because the dragon flew by and like blasted it. And then I did find a temple, which I haven't been into yet. So that's another couple of things that I want to do. I would like to get a lot of the pets and bring them here, but I'm also thinking that I'm going to get a lot of the villagers and bring them here too. So while I was sitting there saying that we we're going to do this way Thumbcraft, we might put like a big hall so they can kind of wander around. I know I wasn't going to put them underground on this part, but the dragon has just been going through. The three that I found have been going through and just blasting every villager that I can find. And I, I don't even get a chance to go ahead and click on them to trade with them beforehand. I did find... Let's see. This one has... I got two sheeps. Two cows and the first blockling that I have found in here. And this one. This one has chickens. Which is the first chickens I found in here that is not modded. So we're going to get that stuff set up and everything to go. And I think we're going to end up picking up a lot of the villagers and just bring them down here. And if they. If I don't need them, I'll just release them. But. There was a lot of villagers in there I've never even messed with and I've never even seen and I kind of want to go ahead and get them and just like test them out. So we might end up putting a big old room <laughs> somewhere that we can end up doing that. And right here kind of seems like it'd be a good, well, this is on the way to the dungeon. It might be better if we go this way and this be my storage area instead of Thomcraft area. Now that I think, and then drop it down, and we'll see how it ends up looking. So, until next time, I am Shaken Ort. If you have any suggestions and comments and anything else, you know, let me know. Because that would be really appreciated. I have been, I have watched a dragon like go ahead and take out like four villagers that I had never seen before. And I was like, no, I don't know what they sell yet. <laughs> so, anyways, until next time, I'm Shaken Ort, and I'll catch you later.